coming up next. Pentra Vajoba Guild stage crew is working hard to help enter the world of Anatevka. Find out how they're bringing Fiddler on the Roof to life. We also take a look at what's going on in sports tonight. All this and more on today's episode of Wake Up Warriors. Live from Penn Trafford High School, this is Wake Up Warriors. Wake Up Warriors starts now. Good morning, Penn Trafford, and welcome to Wake Up Warriors. Today is Wednesday, January 26th. I'm Ava Burdell. And I'm Ella. Musical is such an exciting experience for the actors, but we have forgotten about the backstage ninjas and the behind-the-scenes helpers. The crews are turning the fiddles and starting their behind-the-scenes traditions to get ready to bring Anna Tevka to life. We send their choreography. As the actors are learning their choreography, lines, and music, the various crews around the Pen Travel Drama Guild are beginning to work on their heavy task for this year's spring musical. These crews consist of stage managers, props, set, paint, hair and makeup, and costumes. To learn a little bit more about the crews, we sat down with student stage manager and stage crew coordinator. Uh, currently, stage managers mostly do the blocking. We also run around to get things for the director, um, things for the choreographer. We also sometimes help out with props, sets, it just kind of all depends what needs to be done. I oversee the stage managers and I work with all of the cooperating crews. Um, I help make sure everything is flowing smoothly between the crews and the backstage staff. Stage managers basically run the entire show. They come from the very beginning with auditions and they see it through to rehearsals, the actual shows, and striking up the shows. They are the ones who keep track of the timing, making sure everyone is where they're supposed to be, all the sets and everything get moved, lights, sound, basically every technical aspect of the show is run by the stage managers. So this year has been a little bit different. Um, we have four stage managers unlike two years ago, which we had two stage managers and then the next year we had three stage managers. And just having four stage managers, it just makes the job a whole lot easier and you have so many more people to rely on and so many people that have your back. It's honestly a great experience. Not only do stage managers do so much for the show, but the other crews are just as important. We sat down with Liz Shermita, the prop crew coordinator, to learn more about what her crew is doing to benefit the musical. Our job in the props department is to make anything that's held in the hands of actors and that goes with the set that's not made by the set people. We are in charge of things that have to be made, things that have to be pulled out of the bins behind me, and things that have to be bought. Our first thing is to go and find out what things need to be made, and I do that, and the parents do that, and the crew kids do that. Anything that needs to be pulled from bins, I have all the adults help me do that, and the kids sometimes help me do that, and then anything that needs to be bought, I go on Amazon and I buy it. Reporting for BTTV, this has been Dom Randall. The Student Union is hosting a Morb Dance, which will be held on Saturday, March 5th in the gym from 7 to 10 p.m. The purpose of the dance is to raise money to alleviate the cost of prom. The theme is neon, and no dates are necessary. Tickets are $15 and will be on sale from February 14th to the 23rd in the cafeteria during all lunches. You must be off the restricted list to purchase a ticket. Outside guests are not permitted. Please email Ms. Martini or Mrs. Thornton with more questions or concerns. Attention seniors, extra class of 2022 t-shirts and hoodies are available for purchase in room 138 during homeroom or fifth period. T-shirts are $20 and hoodies are $33. You can pay by check written to Penn Trafford Yearbook or with exact cash. Email Mrs. Thornton or stop by room 138 if you have any questions or would like to purchase. Club Picture Day will take place on Friday, January 28th in the auditorium. A schedule will be emailed to you and posted in your English classrooms. Please report to the auditorium to be photographed with your club at the designated times. There will not be any makeup pictures. Please email Mrs. Thornton with any questions or concerns. The Boys Lacrosse Interest Meeting has been canceled for today. Tonight in sports, the bowling team travels to Greater Latrobe to take on the Wildcats at 3 and the Boys Varsity Wrestling Team versus Kiski at Franklin at 6 o'clock. Good luck to the Warrior teams tonight. 
Thank you for watching Wake Up Worries. Please stand for the Pledge of the Flag. I'm Ava. And I'm Ella. Have a, Have great, a great day, PT. PT.